is it possible for the law enforcement agencies in india to stop someone from leaving the country if in case an fir or other criminal case is pending against such person if it is so then under what law is it possible and what is the procedure about stopping a person from leaving this country hi this is advocate prashant kanha and in this video i am going to talk about the lookout circular that is issued by the indian law enforcement agencies against a person who has any criminal case pending against him so let us first start with what is a lookout circular so a lookout circular is essentially governed by the an office memorandum issued by the home ministry in the year 2010 and then again it was revised in the year 2021 so this office memorandum essentially regulates the lookout circular it gives the procedure that how a lookout circular will originate against which person it will be issued and what would be the procedure to whom it will be submitted and then how it will be circulated on all the airports or the sea ports or the border exit points so essentially a lookout circular is a document or a request letter from the law enforcement agencies to the bureau of immigration requesting that a particular person should be stopped from leaving this country other than requesting that a person should be stopped from leaving this country there can be other request also like informing the originator the law enforcement agency which requested for the lookout circular that they be informed that when the person is entering or leaving the country or when a foreign is a foreigner is entering the country and on certain other issues the office memorandum dated 22nd february 2021 on lookout circular by the ministry of home affairs gives detailed guidelines on the lookout circular so what is the process of issuing of the lookout circular so essentially a lookout circular initiates or is initiated by a law enforcement agency it may be police department it may be the bureau of revenue intelligence it may be the cbi it can be the sfio it can be even banks and many other departments which are enumerated in the office memorandum as i mentioned if an fir has been registered by the police then the investigating officer shall request the superintendent of police or the district magistrate if it is the investigation is being done by some other uh, department at district level then the district magistrate or the superintendent of police or the joint secretary of the state will request the bureau of immigration for issuing a lookout circular against a particular person whose description will be mentioned in the form which is attached with the office memorandum of the home ministry so against what or against which person such lookout circular can be issued so if in case any cognizable offence has been committed by a person under the indian penal code or under any other law and is cognizable in that scenario the originator or the originating department can request for a lookout circular and the person can be detained or stopped this lookout circular can be issued even in family matters and in economical offences white collar crimes in matters of cheating or all the cognizable cases how a victim can get issue a lookout circular so if the victim or the informant or the complainant who has lost the case he can also request the investigating officer or the superintendent of police that a lookout circular may be issued and if it is not being issued then a request can be made to the court to the magistrate to direct the superintendent of police or the police department that lookout circular may be issued but such request have to have cogent reasons supported by or corroborated by some other document or circumstances now the next question that comes is that how an accused person can come to know whether a lookout circular has been issued against him well with respect to this thing about knowing about a lookout circular by the accused person there is no 
central server or there is no central database that from where he can inquire but an inquiry can be made by him from the police station or from the investigating officer or from the court where the case is pending and if he knows that some cognizable offense or offense under which lookout circular can be issued then in that scenario he should inquire from the office where the case has been registered that would be the best source to inquire about such lookout circular you cannot file an rti to the bureau of immigration inquiring about whether a lookout circular is issued against the accused person or not but the best way to find is to find from the place the office the police station or the cbi office where the case is registered or from the court if in case you think that so you cannot just pinpoint one place that from here you can inquire you have to go before the various offices which concern your case so by approaching these places you can inquire and if in case you get to know that a lookout circular has been issued against you at that stage very itself you can challenge so what is the process to challenge a lookout circular so at first place if in case it has been issued by the officer who is inquiring the matter then an application can be made to the officer itself for cancelling the lookout circular assuring that you will be participating in the investigation or if you think that you have not taken the bail bail so far in the matter you can apply for bail and once you have the bail you can very well appear before the investigating officer and then you can always request for the cancellation of the lookout circular if in case the officer is not cancelling the lookout circular it will be cancelled by the officer who requested for the issuance of the lookout circular so if he is not cancelling then you can approach the court normally people approach the high court but uh, it is it is it is not a law that only high court can cancel but even the magistrate can direct the uh, concerned investigating officer if the lookout circular has been issued by police then in that scenario even magistrate can direct that the lookout circular be recalled or cancelled by the police investigating officer but let us say that the uh, lookout circular has been issued by any other department let us say by bank by ed by cbi or any other intelligence revenue all these departments other than police investigating officer then high court would be the proper remedy with uh, by filing a writ of certiorari and a writ of mandamus so this is how you can get the loc cancelled normally it is also a question that what is tenure of this loc so as per the office memorandum of the ministry of home affairs it is for one year until and unless a renewal is sought by the uh, originating officer who has requested for the issuance of the lookout circular if that has not been done by him then in that scenario the lookout circular will automatically expire after one year sometimes it also happens that despite the cancellation of the lookout circular by the court still the information may not have been forwarded by the originator or the investigating officer to the bureau of immigration so in that scenario what should a person do against whom the lookout circular was earlier issued so whenever you get an stay order from the high court or the concerned court then in that scenario you must get multiple certified copies of the court order and give it to the originating officer give it to the district magistrate or the higher officer who is responsible or who was responsible in your case for requesting the loc and also sent a letter along with a certified copy to the bureau of immigration and also if you are traveling after that carry the certified copy of the court order so that if in case the lookout circular has not been recalled at from the airport then in that scenario you can show the certified copy of the court's order in that scenario the immigration officer will try to confirm that from the investigating officer 
and thereafter they may allow you to travel and if in case they do not allow you travel allow you to travel then in that scenario there will be a contempt of court committed by the immigration officer plus the officer originating officer who requested for the loc and did not take appropriate step to recall the loc despite orders of the court now there is another scenario in which you may not be aware that loc has been issued against you and you are traveling and you are offloaded or you are arrested by the uh, immigration officer or stopped by the immigration officer and then handed over to the local police in that scenario you have a right uh, to request the immigration officer for the copy of the loc so if in case you are detained by the police you can always get that loc challenged and at the same time if the loc was issued because you are not appearing before the court or not appearing before the concerned department which was issuing summons to you or where the nbw was issued then along with the loc also get that nbw or the order of the court or the uh, whatever direction whatever order was passed by the department from the concerned court or try to get bail another question that arises is that if in case the person has bail then in that scenario can loc be issued so answer would be that if in case a person has bail that means he is not absconding and he is presenting himself before the court or the investigating officer in that scenario issuance of the loc would be highly illegal and you will get remedy from the high court in that scenario so this is this is all about the issuance of the loc the process which is followed for issuance of the lookout circular and the remedy available to the accused person to get the loc cancelled and also the rights available to the victim to get an lookout circular issued against a person thank you so much hope this video was helpful